Well, I'm having a Mick morning. Had a Mick breakfast. I'm gonna get, get Mick going here soon. And I was only gonna spend a short Mick time in there at McDonald's. But uh, <laughs> uh, the, the store manager came along and started talking to me and uh, I think we had a great conversation. I, I do wanna say one thing and I've said it before. All food is healthy, it's just how you apply it. And believe me, the kilometers I'm putting down, the best thing for me this morning to eat is eggs. And I got that in the form of an egg McMuffin, actually three. So I, I got myself three egg McMuffins and some hotcakes and a little bit of orange juice. And that's gonna last me right through into the afternoon. So it's very important to get that in. So I was hoping for, I was really hoping for a fast, uh, breakfast as, as it is break fast that's what I want to be doing uh, instead I had a well Hill me the fine uh, manager here of McDonald's came over and he gave me a few coup coupons and um, uh, for some Big Macs up the road so that's that's gonna be great uh, I'll be looking forward to that but even though, as I was saying to him part of my training I would have a be very very stringent on what I ate very strict and portionate so I'd go to work and I'd have these little dishes made up uh, tuna onion on top of the tuna uh, vegetables chopped up I think it was rutabaga and carrots and maybe some cabbage put in there and then the topped it off with rice and that's what I would eat every two three hours Basically, when I started to feel hungry, I would just fill up my stomach on that and that alone. Um, ended up losing 30 pounds, came down to a weight of 178. And that was before the walk, and months and months before. My, my, I call it my fighting, fighting weight. 178 is my ideal weight. That's my ultimate health. So, that's what I went with. Uh, but the end of my work rotation, my shift, my uh, fellow workers knew and they, they would joke about it like because I would eat so strictly. They said at the end of that rotation they said, you going to McDonald's? I'm like, yep. <laughs> and I'd go down, I'd get myself a Big Mac, um, large fries and a sundae. And at the end of every rotation, that's the way it was as part of the routine. And it worked out great and it didn't matter about me eating that. My weight still stayed at 178, but it was healthy. Like, and I, I was, I think I talked about body mechanics before that you ask for an upgrade. You, you work hard, you push yourself hard, you eat right, and you're, you're looking for that personal upgrade to make yourself stronger and better and go further. Um, and, you know, that's what I'm doing here today with the, uh, going from Calgary to Banff and then back to Calgary is to train and condition and try to build my body stronger and better. You know, my mind, the body, the spirit. And it's great to talk to people and meet people too. But, um, you know, and what I'm doing is really talking to those inner mechanics of myself. The ones that are putting me together and making me stronger and fitter and, and more able. And, you know, to beat whatever those physical handicaps might be uh, that, I, that I am beating. But, uh, you know, my mechanics, they want, they, they want some good food. <laughs> but every so often, one of those mechanics goes to me, Hey, uh, hey Trevor, we've been working really hard on your form here and uh, building your, uh, your body and making your car rev and, you know, your inner workings work for you. But, you know what I need today? Can you just go out and get me a burger? So, you know, that's, that's basically what it wants. And it's, it's a healthy... A healthy thing to do <laughs> but anyways I'm gonna let you go folks and I'm gonna head further up the road here um, got people walk, walking around walking by and, and looking and I certainly want to stop and talk to some people so I'm gonna get on the move um, and I will I will say this again the more you move the more you move others and uh, thank you Hilmi for offering some nourishment along my way um, which I'll enjoy and with each one of those coupons you gave me, uh, that's it, it. It does move me in ways that I would not even be able to say with words, but I'll try to do that with my actions. So thank you again, Hilmi, and uh, thanks for <laughs> thanks.
that wonderful little meal that's going to carry me all the way to Canmore. <laughs>